It can often feel like it's the criminals who are one step ahead of law enforcement. In a dramatic turning of the tables, the global underworld has been duped by the authorities. More than 800 suspected criminals from 18 countries arrested after being tricked into using an FBI-run encrypted chat app that allowed police to secretly monitor millions of messages, all in real time. We have been in the back pockets of organised crime. All they talk about is drugs, violence, uh, hits on each other, uh, innocent people who are going to be murdered. Operation Trojan Shield was first hatched in 2018 when the U.S. FBI began operating its own encrypted device company called Anom. Informants were used to distribute customized phones with the messaging app to the criminal underworld. Within a year and a half, more than 12,000 of the devices were being used by more than 300 criminal syndicates in more than 100 countries. Uh, we were able to actually see photographs of hundreds of tons of cocaine that were concealed in shipments of fruit. We were able to see hundreds of kilos of cocaine that were concealed in canned goods. With no voice, video, or email functions, the gangs believe the phones were secure, which led to what police described as brazen messages. One murder plot involved an attack on a cafe in Australia with a machine gun. Another targeted a family of five. In total, police say more than 100 murders have been prevented. The sting reached deep into Europe with raids across the block. 75 suspects were detained in Sweden, dozens more in the Netherlands and Germany. These, are, um, these raids are a significant blow to organized crime, which is more and more relying on encrypted communication systems. Encrypted messaging has become a crucial tool for the criminal underworld, allowing gangsters to evade law enforcement while remaining global. But authorities are cracking down. In the past year, two major messaging apps in Europe were dismantled, which in part led to Anom's popularity.